All right, Kendra, thanks so much. Well, after an upstate contestant on America's Got Talent died from an overdose earlier this week, her mom speaking out to us for the first time. Skylar Hicks was just 23 years old, but we have learned the young star was fighting battles that many people had no clue about, and it's typically how a lot of this goes. It's sad. Only on Fox tonight, Brooklyn Cromer sat down with her mom. Brooklyn, it's heartbreaking knowing that you know, so many people saw her as one way, but behind closed doors, it sounds like she was dealing with a lot of battles. That's right, Cody. It's absolutely heartbreaking. Her mom and siblings are just beside themselves over this loss. And her mom tonight opens up about her battle with mental illness. And also, she tells me how songwriting helped her cope. Skyler's mom says she was diagnosed with bipolar disorder as a teen and also struggled with substance abuse throughout her life. Back in 2013, Skyler told audiences she started singing to help cope with her father's death, who passed away a few years before her time on America's Got Talent. Her mom says she found her voice after her dad passed away and went from a shy teenager to a self-trained musician overnight. Skyler's mom wants to end the stigma associated with mental illness and is relying on faith to get her through. With Skylar, no matter what, you know, like knowing that there's that chance that um, that you could get that phone call, I, you know, it was one of those things I said, man, if I lose her tomorrow, like she's going to know that she was loved, you know, like she's going to know that. Skyler was found dead at a home in Liberty on Monday. The Pickens County Sheriff's Office says she died from a suspected overdose, and the Sheriff's Office is still investigating. And if you or a loved one is struggling with mental illness or addiction, you can call the number here on your screen for the National Substance Abuse and Mental Health Services Helpline. Now, coming up at 11, I'll have much more with Skyler's mom, and she's also telling me how she plans to start a foundation in her daughter's honor. Reporting live in Greer, Brooklyn Cromer, Fox Carolina News.